you doing, folks? I'm Jamie. This is Bama, and we're here to tell you some great songs. Great tonight. songs. Some of the best songs. All these songs made the Billboard Top 1 million at some point in the history <laughs> of the life of the world. And at one point, all of them had also just been made. Yes, and at one point, they were all written. Written in the stars. Written in the stars <laughs> by the stars. And by stars, of course, we mean the unsung heroes of the entertainment world. Abbott and Costello. No, close. No. <laughs> I think they're pretty famous. <laughs> no, 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 Bama. I'm talking about the puppeteer. The puppeteer. Songs of the puppeteer. That's right. By the puppeteer. N yes. There's actually a couple songs in here from the band The Puppeteers. Yes, they're really good. You know what? Band. Well, the thing with the puppeteers is they had to pull a few strings to get ahead. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Anyways. But we have a great list of songs here. Do we, uh, Jeffrey? We do, Dahmer. Dahmer. <laughs> <laughs> like that great new wave 80s hit. Pull my string. Fastly. As in parentheses. Let's listen to that one. Functions and kind of just. <laughs> it was done during the recording. It, it was, but we think the authentic sound is more. What when I think authentic. of the wiggles? What do you think of when you hear the wiggles? Jello. And what does Jello make you think of? Bill Cosby. And what does Bill Cosby make you think of? Bing Crosby. That's right. That's exactly and what right. does Bing Crosby remind you of? Christmas puppet songs, specifically that one song. I'm not a puppet. I'm a Nutcracker. <laughs> That's the classic one, my Bing Crosby. Here comes that classic Christmas song. I'm not a puppet, I'm a nutcracker. Yeah, it was it was tragic. 
But do you know, our last song here is actually by a very famous person who didn't do very many songs. But... Pinocchio! No. He did spend a lot of time with puppets. Oh, I know who you're talking about. The government. <laughs> no. But he would make a good president. Fred Rogers. Oh, Mr. Rogers, you are right. And his... Classic hit, I wish I could marry you, Henrietta Pussycat, if only you were a puppet. And a cat. <laughs> Hang on, let me see if the CD working. Okay. Mr. Rogers is going to sing today. He's going to sing a song for the neighbors. About Henrietta Pussycat <clears throat> and the tale that never was. <laughs> so we're gonna sing it today. Yes, we are. There we go. Okay. We're gonna sing out loud. Everyone turns the scene off. <laughs> Won't you be my neighbor? <laughs> That's actually pretty oh, Mr. Rogers didn't really have much to do on that CD. <laughs> he really didn't. He, he had a basis for a song, but then none he of the. Did. None of the people showed up to play the instruments. Yeah, and you know, he was kind of, he still, give props to him for still trying to make the song, but, you know. You know, only, Fred Rogers can only do so much, unless he was in the land of make-believe. Yeah, the land of make-believe, he could write songs all day. Mm -hmm. We great. could have people sing them in the land of make-believe. That is right, Tommy. All right, John. <laughs> all right, that's all the time we have tonight. That's all we got. So. Cut those strings and walk over to the phone and dial right now for this exclusive CD offer of 12,000 songs on one tiny micro disc. Tiny. It is as big as my fingernail. Okay, so find something that can play it. Because there hasn't been anything to invent it yet. No, but that's why we're having so much trouble. That's all right. Just stay tuned for your weekly update of the great show. Mr. Rogers and the school children. <laughs> we'll be right back. Wow. We're never doing that game again.